Good afternoon, family. This is Maddie Symphony Journey. Hi, family. I've got some packages today. I'm just going to share them. Let's make an extra video. I got packages in the mail that I ordered from Amazon. Let me move this out the way. Y'all, this is my pot of beans. I made some pinto beans. And I got some fried, I'm going to make deep fried chicken. My chicken is, uh, is marinating. Okay, I'm trying to. Okay. All right. Mm. Natural black hair color shampoo with olive oil. Now, this is supposed to be good. I've seen somebody that's used it. Easy color in five minutes. Uh... So, 100% grade cover. This is about $18. So, one my package. Let's see what's in, what's in the next one. Okay, mullen leaf. Mullen. This is for um, colds, supposed to help with mucus and stuff. So I'm gonna use that oh, lipstick. Mm-hmm. I'll order a little line. Yeah. And yeah, y'all, there's just one of in this big old package. Really? I have a couple more items. Okay, I'm gonna share this with you guys. Now, I heard about using castor packages. It's supposed to be good for, uh, I think, liver detox and different type of detox. So, I bought these things here. Castor detox packages. So, we'll see how those work. And I will share it. See if it's worth the money. I already got some organic castor. This is, oh, oh, okay, and I got Wild Organic Slippery Am. This could be good for you as well. Boy, they could have put all this stuff in one pot. They, like, they need to shop like Timu shops. I mean, ships. Timu ships. Got them in the pair of Crocs. Yeah, because I keep putting on somebody else's croc that I originally bought. But he somehow bribed me out of them. And Candy 2 Sandal Crocs. Y'all, these are very easy and comfortable to wear. I'm going to tell y'all something. Do not put your crocs in the sun. Do not, do not put your crocs in the sun wreak habit on them. So these are going to be very, very comfortable to wear around here when I don't feel like putting on shoes. Just throw these on. And, uh, yeah. And these are size 8. Yeah, size 8, women 8. Let's see how they, how they fit. Maybe I should have got a 7. That's okay. It's a little, little, little big, but it's okay. I'll be all right with them. I'm going to take this off. Crocs, 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 Crocs. And I'm getting ready to mail this here back to the company. I have this thing here. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to need that thing, huh? But, uh, all right. My new Crocs, yay! Y'all, you talking about comfortable? Oh, yeah. Just slide my feet in them. And I can get go. Go, go, go. These packages are going to be trash. Make sure I don't leave anything in them. But these are my Amazon hauls. Amazon hauls. Yeah. Beauty. 
So. I'm going to put these in the storage for a minute. I don't like to go fast and they real fast. So I'm going to put them in storage for a little bit outside. Yeah, these things are a little big. I think I thought I used to get eight, but apparently I think I get sevens because these are, these are kind of on the big side. But that's okay. I ain't going to worry about it. All right, Kim, so these are some of the healthcare things for me that I ordered. Barber Aid, Barber Shop Aid, the profession brand product, Natural Black. So we're going to be doing this here. I'm going to do the mulling leaf for my congestion. And Slippery Am is good for your throat as well. So I bought these bottles here. And I needed some more lipstick. It was amazing, but I do I order my lipstick because it's hard to get it. They have the company brand lipstick in Walmart down here, but the color that I want, they just stay out of it. So I just think I want to start ordering that stuff online. Mmm, nice little color. It's nice and moist. My uh, Amazon shopping haul. <laughs> beauty products. Beauty, beauty products. So I'll be working on my hair. I'm getting ready for a road trip. Let's open up this package, huh? Oh. Okay. Oh. I'm going to draw all this. Where are some scissors at? Okay, I'm going to hit the top. Oh, okay. Castor pack, anti-leak, reusable, adjustable size, storage bag design. Hi, yes, and spend that. Oh, I thought, I thought that was going to get me in the bag. I thought the color just cut, cut them out. Yeah. So this is for what's your face? This for your eyes? Oh, no. I think your neck. <laughs> and these are for, mm hmm. I think, I ain't gonna say it, I ain't gonna say it, I ain't gonna say it. I'm about to say it. Okay, yeah. So your neck, neck, your uh, belly, and I think the other one's for your boobs, I believe. Because they're not sure what the other one's used for. So you're supposed to line this up with Kestrel, or I think, yeah, I have to read on these things, but kind of be. Anyway, it's supposed to detox your liver, detox your liver. And I guess other glands or whatever in your body that need to detox them. Yeah, I'm going to tell y'all a good detoxing to use, too. Let me tell y'all. It's um, onion. You can take a yellow onion, slice it. And put it on your feet, put a pair of socks on. And by morning, that onion will be cooked. And you will feel so much better. I did an onion detox before. And it is 100% great. An onion detox. Yeah. Let me see what the slippery mullen leaf, mullen leaf, fragile glass bottle. Liquid drops. Shape it for you. Add one full squeeze Doppler bubble to two ounces of juice of water three times daily. I'm going to start on this today, the mullen. Yeah, I'm going to start the mullen today to help with the phlegm and the cough stuff or whatever I'm dealing with. 
and it's from the same company, Wild Organic. Yeah, I didn't pay attention to that. And Slippery M. That's good for your throat because I've been coughing and all that stuff a lot. I want to make sure my throat is taken care of. Shake before using. Add one full squeeze of the droplet bubble. But to two ounces of water, choose three times daily. So both of these use three times daily. Yeah, I'm gonna get ready to fry my chicken. Uh, I'm hungry, family. I've had food early this morning. I eat like early, early today. This morning, sometime I haven't eaten anything since. So I'm hungry. Uh, Homie loves bread, so get little fell some bread. But yes, here come my pot of pinto beans that I cooked today. Let me show you guys. I brought my cooking last night. I cooked my pinto beans last night. I had a little bit of beef in there, a little ground beef. I had a little bit left, so I just went and put the little ground beef in here. But yeah, and I have uh, turkey smoked turkey parts in there and i have some uh beef smoked sausages in there i put plenty of onions you know <coughs> so mm. y'all look good i'm gonna get ready to fry some chicken mm. what is my chicken so I'm going to put my apron on so I won't, won't mess up the shirt. Mm -hmm. I season with garlic, onion powder, uh, chicken chicken sauce, chicken chick, chicken chicken seasoning. Mm. I'll put just a little bit of Himalaya salt in it. Not much, just a little bit. I use Weber chicken chicken. And I also put some, um, put hot sauce and mustard. I love my hot sauce and mustard. And I am going to double batter this chicken. It's going to be double fried, double batter. So, it's time for me to get to cooking. I already got my rice is done. I don't know why I didn't buy any Kool-Aid. Because I thought about having Kool-Aid with my um, fried chicken. Mm, mm, mm. Kool-Aid with my fried chicken, y'all. It's delicious. I'm going to fry my chicken in this little pan here. Let me see. Oh, y'all, I bought this here. Now, in Arizona, and what this is, this is something that you put your, your grease, you store your own grease in. And it's, it's silicone. So, I'm not going to use this grease. This is my fish grease and shrimp. And I need to get another one of these here. I need another one. So it's easy. Put it right here on this thing here. It fits there perfectly. Oh. So it fits perfect. So let's see. I need to get need a bowl. Southern fried chicken. I don't have any more paper bowls. Guess I'll get one of these babies here and put some cold water in it. Uh, okay. Okay. I have to use, do my flour. I should sure have flour, y'all. Very, very special needs. She has been super patient. 
with me getting her okay that's cornmeal where's my flour It would be fair for me to keep y'all online while I uh, fry this chicken. Now, family, I just wanted to uh, come on here and show y'all my little uh, Amazon haul of uh, beauty aid stuff. I'm doing it. I'm not using chicken batter. I'm making my own chicken chicken batter stuff. The chicken been seasoned pretty good, so. It's been sitting pretty good. So, let me see. I might need a bigger bag. But I'm going to put this to the side. Put this thing on. Yeah, I know family, it's time for me to hit them. It's time for me to hit them gray spots, okay? I'll be, and I got my little crocs on too. They are a little big. I got an eight. I thought I was buying these things at eight. I thought I had, I mean, buying sevens or something. I don't know. Now I'm going to do my little salt and pepper. That's all I'm going to put in this here. Have some cold water. Let me go down and start. Uh, Heating up my pan here. I don't know if I'm gonna need this. I'm gonna put this to the side. I'm gonna need this one here to, to put the cold water in. Okay, family. So I had a little situation to go on when I was in Arizona. I don't know if I completely told you all about it, but um, yeah, a little bump of a bump in Arizona when I got into Chandler, Arizona. Uh, I had a little bump of a bump. And uh, so I had to have some work done on my car. I had my front brakes done. I had my tires been badly rotated. And uh, and I went to uh, um, Discount Tires. I've been going to Discount Tires for years. So I went to Discount Tires down there in uh, Arizona. And um, so you like the one in Houston trying to get me to buy tires, and I didn't need tires. Eventually, I'll need some eventually, but I didn't need any right weight. So, uh, so I had um went to the discount ties, and um, so they didn't want they didn't want to rotate or spin balance my tires at all, saying because they was trying to get me to buy new tires, so they didn't do neither one. And the, the, the sad part about it is that I had already gone to another company say you don't need tires. And I understand people be trying to make their money and all that stuff, but if I don't need tires, if I'm a if I'm a regular customer, been doing discount tires for many years, and they see my information, they clearly see my information. Yeah, I've been being buying tires and discount tires for every day. I know y'all probably know it. They probably know they tell or whatever it is. Uh, they probably know I'm tired on whatever they know. I don't care. I mean, to be concerned about what they know and what they got. I don't care. My concern was how I was treated. You know, after I've been there many, many years, my ties was not up to be changed yet. And I went to another company. They clearly said, no, they don't need change right now. And the tires, they were 80,000 miles on the tires. And hell, it barely been 40,000. If it's, if it's even 40,000, probably even 40,000. So they're trying to intimidate me to buy new tires. You know, so the little young lady that was in the store, 
run around there with a man that must with a masculine energy. I'm not intimidated by a woman that wants to be a man. Never will be. Okay. Never will be. Be you, do yourself. But don't bring that in until over here. Because I'm not, I don't, I'm not intimidated by it. Not at all whatsoever. I don't care what anybody become, what they choose to do with their life. That's their problem, not my problem. Not my problem. You know. I accept anybody from who they are, how they are, whatever. That, you know, you do what you want to do. That's your business. I, I don't care. I can 100% care less that somebody want to play the role of whatever they want to play. I don't care. Enjoy your life. Make it work for you. But, uh, yeah, she had made a little other comment. I hope you make it back to Louisiana on them tires. Hmm. That ain't set well with me. I took the social media. Okay? Now, the manager was kind enough today. He called me today. Because I did go online and made my complaint. You know. Because I was really, really pissed off. It's more so that they try to sell me tires and I don't need them. You know, when it comes time to me getting new tires, I know it's time to get new tires, I'll get new tires. That's not a problem. I'll put the money down and get what I need to get. It's not a big deal. But to intimidate someone, to try to intim intimidate me to buy new tires, that don't work with me. It doesn't work. Doesn't work at all. Ooh, boy, it smells good, y'all. Smells good. So, so the manager called, apologized, and everything, and I told him what she looked like hiking and everything. I don't remember her name. I thought my son remembered her name, but he don't remember her name. So, but he said that I know who you're talking about because she's no longer with us. To tell me I hope you make it back to Louisiana on those ties. That was a little bit much. You know. You got your little energy, your little masculine energy working, but it ain't gonna work on me. And I think somebody say that. That was ugly. Now, I made sure I got that card. I made sure I got that card. I said, okay. Because I had the card because I was coming back. I had to sketch appointment to come back, so I had to keep the card. So I, uh, and I, I, did, I didn't go any further than I was in the parking lot. I went by the Walmart, parked out there, went in the store, set out for about an hour and a half until time for me to go back to the to the place for them to um, spin bounds and rotate my tires. They still did not spin bounds and rotate those tires, but they trying to force me to get new tires. But I went to Sam's Club in uh, Arizona, and they spin bounds rotating. So you don't need tires right now. The man said, you know, as hot as in Arizona, by the end of summer, you may need some by then. And I said, well, I don't, I'm not, you know, I don't live here. So, you're saying because the heat, the heat, the heat, the rubble up and stuff like that. Yeah, I understand that. Come on, Grease, heat up. Let me get this out of the way. So, y'all, I use coconut oil. This is what I use to uh, fry my fish, chicken, and stuff in coconut oil. Oh, Lord, I'm hungry. I am so hungry. Let me take my rice out. My rice on been cooked. Rice. I'll have to heat that up. Y'all, I made some brownies the other day with better cracker. Y'all, all the water and the um, oil that I put in there, this thing was still on the dry side. 
that bag of cracker stuff must be a chemically engineered stuff. But it did not at all work well for me. It totally completely did not taste like it was old bag of cracker. So apparently they this processed or genetically engineered. I didn't look at the bag, but the way it felt and tasted, it was bad. It was bad, bad. The little fella should be rolling in here. Yeah, it should be coming in the morning. I haven't heard the bus yet. But yeah. So I'm gonna go out and clean up my car today for my trip for Friday. I'll be leaving out here for Friday morning. So I'm gonna clean my car today and I'm gonna work on my toes. Then I'm gonna head to Lake Charles in the morning to have a full manicure pedicure. And the reason why I'm working on my toes because I have a little corn and I'm gonna get that off. Maybe I should use some long one for this here. So I'm gonna double dip my chicken. Got my flour batter working. Okay, it's, it's about, yeah, it's ready. So let's double dip. I am hungry, hungry, hungry. And the fella, he gonna probably gonna want some, uh, when they come in, they, he, he come in, he be wanting some, uh, what is that stuff you want? Uh, peanut butter jelly sandwich, stuff like that. Now he can eat now, have peanut butter jelly sandwich later, he can want. Let me try to bring it down a little bit more so y'all can see it. Okay. I'm leaning. All right, let's get another piece of chicken in here right quick. Double dip, dip in the water. Back in the flour. Merch it really good in the flour. Maybe it's just over. Here we go. Look at that. Look at that. Put some in here. Let's see here and keep it all in here. I can put in here. Yeah. Get them all in here and get them battled up. And... Battle up right there. The only thing about that bat, you have to have stuff all over your finger and your hand. Oh, the only thing about that bat, I ain't crazy about it. I got a lot of skills. You probably have a fresh chicken tomorrow, too. I don't, I'm not going to uh, cook all of this in one day. Now y'all, it's amazing. But he likes, like, when I fry this here, he likes that. <laughs> I think that's a bug. Yeah, there it is. He, yeah, there go the bus. He must have got dropped off right there. Sometimes he'll go on down to his, to his place. So, all right, fam, this is Natty Simple New Journey. I'm not going to have it in the cracker box on the video. So I'm going to crack a box. And he just might come up and show his face. So let me see where he at. Oh, yeah, I see him now. Yeah, he's, he's walking on. All right, family, this is Harry Tiffany Journey. This one, you know show y'all my Amazon haul and um yeah we discussed some things about my experience with discount tire there in Arizona when I was down there and 
I'm getting ready to have the good old southern fried chicken, double dip battle with red beans and rice. I want some tea, but I don't feel like uh, some people like to eat that way. I want some tea, but shoot. I got that got so good off of that too. But anyway, family, this is Nettie Simpson and Journey. It's about the journey. You guys be blessed and we will chat later on. Bye-bye. Hit the like, subscribe, and share.